Meanwhile, staying with Shanghai, the price of eggs has been sliding in the city over the past few days, influenced by this new 87N9 virus spreading through the city. One analyst, though, says the price decrease is only temporary and it's expected to rise fast once the disease is controlled. Our Zhang Tao has more details. Poultry booths in this Shanghai market are empty, and the egg business has been affected in this turn. One egg merchant here said he's staying in business, but that customers are buying fewer eggs than normally. The price was 9 or 9.2 yuan per kilo previously, but now it has dropped 0.4 yuan. Fewer people are buying. Because of the bird flu, I'm only buying half of what I bought before. A farm price website says egg prices have dropped about 0.4 yuan per kilogram on average in Shanghai this month. One analyst says this is primarily the effect of bird flu worries. Demand declined dramatically. Well, supply hasn't changed yet, so it's normal to see a price decline. We think it will continue to go down. But Lian warns that the market should expect a rebound in egg prices after the flu is declared under control. Many chicken raisers, especially individual raisers, are not able to bear the loss, so they will reduce production. When the bird flu's influence ends, the low production will push egg prices up. Shanghai has closed its three poultry slaughterhouses and 461 poultry retailing outlets since last Saturday. Poultry vendors and farmers are being subsidized for at least half of their losses. Zhang Tao, ICS4 CCTV, Shanghai.